Hello friends, welcome back to Health Highlights where I spend the time learning about all things health and bring you the highlights. I came across a podcast that discussed holiday hacks to avoid gaining weight and wanted to share this information with you. I will include a link in the description bar below in case you want to listen to the podcast in its entirety. Some of these ideas will reinforce what you have heard, but other ideas will be great to keep in your back pocket. Let's get started. Focus on your relationships with family and friends. Don't stress about what you're going to eat. If you are focused on the fear of binging or eating poorly, you will create imbalance, stress, and may restrict, which will make you go crazy with your eating in the long run. Relax, enjoy yourself, connect with others. Remember why you are there. This will get you into a more natural balance, helping you to naturally make better decisions. Always remember that you don't have to be perfect, so don't put that pressure on yourself. Be happy and take pleasure in your relationships. Eat slower. This helps give your body time to register what it has eaten and for your brain to receive the message that it is full. Eat mindfully. Enjoy the bite of food in your mouth, not the bite of food you are about to put in your mouth. Eat protein first. Protein is the most satiating of the macronutrients. Fat is next, followed by carbohydrates. Eat your protein first to help your brain receive the full signal sooner. Do something active. Hike, play football, take a walk with loved ones after you eat. Walking after you eat will not only help your blood sugar, but will get you away from the food so you don't keep eating. Maybe you want to do a workout in the morning to not only ensure you get some activity in for the day, but also help set the tone for the day. It may help you make better food choices. It will also help you have higher drive and motivation and will keep you sharper and more positive. Wait 15 minutes before you eat seconds. After 15 minutes, you may not want to eat anything else or you may want to eat less than you thought you would. Bring a dish to share. Maybe you know your body will digest food better if you eat roasted vegetables with it. So, you bring a roasted vegetable dish to help you digest the other food you are going to eat. Maybe since you don't know what will be served, you want to bring a dish you know you will be able to eat, and you eat that. Away from home and away from your gym, take a week off of working out. You will lose some muscle, but you will gain it back quickly due to muscle memory. Don't want to take a break? Mix up your routine. Surprise your body. It will be good for it. Introduce new exercises, or do ones you don't normally do. Change up the number of reps you do and or the types of exercises you do. For example, take longer to do a rep, like one minute to do one squat. Do mobility work. Do a YouTube body weight workout. Do some sprints or high intensity interval training. There are many options to working out without a gym. Associate food with good and bad things. Be aware of how food makes you feel. You will begin to make healthier choices naturally. You will want to feel good and have more energy. Pay attention to how you feel after you eat food. Did it give you heartburn or make you feel sluggish or did it give you energy? You will start to gravitate toward healthy food that makes you feel your best and you won't need willpower to do it. Don't say I can't eat that. Say I don't want to eat that. If there's food you don't want to eat, say you don't want to eat it. If you say you can't eat it, people want to try and change your mind to eat it. If you say you don't want to eat it, they typically accept this and leave you alone. Thank you for coming along on our health journey together. I hope these holiday hacks help you to enjoy this time of year. Let me know in the comments what holiday hacks work for you. Like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you don't miss any health highlights. Until next time, here's to health.